She's a Mona Lisa Everyone's lining up to see her She's a Mona Lisa Everyone's lining up to see her There must be something that feeds her You'll find her beauty goes much deeper Once you get to meet her Hello what's up from the lab, it is me Mercedes And in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys Me trying out a bunch of new curly hair products I have a lot of curly hair products that I've been wanting to try out That I heard of a bunch of like good buzz on so we shall see how they work. This is like the results of my hair. We shall see how it looks when it's dry. But yeah, today's video I'm gonna be trying out a bunch of new hair products from Miss Jessie's, Chicks Curls Line, Can Two, Garnier for Tees. We're getting it all checked out. If you like this video, feel free to give it a thumbs up. If you're already new to my channel, feel free to subscribe. But without further ado, let's go ahead and get on to this video. <laughs> so I'm gonna be trying some new curly hair products. I just recently bought one, two, three, four, like, a, like more than a couple of new hair products to try. Um, I may make this into a two-day video. I might film another one of me doing hair styling on Friday with this other hair product that I've been wanting to try. Just really good. So I'll start off with the one that's right in front of me, which is the Garnier Fertis Curl Nourish Leave-In Treatment. Basically, it's an air dry buttercream for nourished, frizz resistant curls, and it's 24 hour first control. And I got this as a new leave in conditioner. My previous leave in conditioner that I used to style in my hair is similar to this one, it was also Garnier for Tees. Um, this I already like been using for like a month now, but it's still kind of new to me. It's the Miracle Curls. I just bought another one because I ran out of the other one. I've been using it up. It's frizz taming cream. Basically, it tames the frizz because that's the I feel like that's the root of all my problems with my curly hair is basically my frizz control like it's out of control the that I got is the mixed chicks curl sculptor this is fast drying weightless curl creator provides definition for curls textures elongates curls soften and moisturizes with pro vitamin b5 basically it hydrates and nourishes your hair and it's like a curl sculptor for air dry hair like if you leave your hair wet and you style it wet and then you let it air dry which is what i normally do i air dry my hair brand i got the miss jessie multicultural curls it's basically um a wash and go type styling product it's a it's a it's a curling lotion and apparently everyone has been raving on and on about it. I saw it on TikTok, a girl use it. I saw my sister told me about it. Like everybody's been saying Miss Jessie's products are the way to go. So I just tried it. It was a bit on the expensive side. I think it was $17 and something cents. But still, I feel like it's worth it. If you have really curly hair and you want to like make it as smooth and like defined as possible, this is the way to go. I only tried Miss Jessie's Quick Curls. Um, this is like a curling cream. And it's kind of like for curly hair, it's wash and go. When your hair is wet, you apply it. It's for like air dry hair. Like when your hair is wet, you just want to apply it and it's like quick curls, which is what it's called. So yeah. And then the last thing I got is Jelly Soft Curls. This is basically a curling, basically a styling jelly, a styling gel. I, I use that. So that's just basically gel that you use to scrunch into your hair to style it and leave it into place. But apparently this one is supposed to be soft curls, meaning like it's not supposed to be hard, kind of like mousse or actual hard gel would do. So Alright, so a couple of other styling products that I got from Miss Jessie was the last one, which is the Rapid Recovery Treatment. I have not yet tried this. I, try, I was going to try this in the shower today, but I was already doing a lot with my hair. I was using a... a so if I do continue this video on into a two-day video, I'll show me using this on Friday, which is regularly when I'm going to do my deep treatment, when it says once a week. So I'm planning on my Fridays being my once a week. So I'm going to try this. I'll let you guys know how it goes. I'm trying this is a Cantu Flaxseed Smoothing Cream Gel with aloe, honey, and shea butter and vitamin E. Defines and softens. This is a flexible hold. And it's basically a styling hair product, so I'm going to try this out today too. And I'll let you guys know what I think about all And then last but not least, we already know my protein black, black gel. I'm going to be using this just to style my hair into place, like the shape of my part for when I wear it down, which is the look that I'm going for today, which is down. And yeah, but without further ado, let's go ahead and try, try all, all these products 
get started. So this is my hair, how it looks. Now we're gonna style it. This is how it looks after washing it and after the hair mask and everything. I mean, I will say it looks okay. Like this side looks pretty defined, honestly, it does. This side looks a little frizzy, very frizzy actually. So we're gonna try to fix that up with these styling products. So the first step is to create a part. The first step is to create a part. Normally I don't part my hair with a comb, but today I wanted to part my hair with a comb because I wanted this look to turn out the best possible way. And already combing my hair already made it very frizzy, which is why I don't like combing my hair with a part, with a, parting my hair with a comb. Now we're gonna slip back this. I will say my hair is extremely soft right now, like from that hair mask or whatever I did. I think it was the hair mask because normally I do use the Aussie curl, but whatever I did, my hair is extremely soft, so I will give it props to that. Okay, now we're gonna re wet my hair. And that's the best possible way I feel like to go about it is to have your hair wet. So now I'm gonna apply the leave-in conditioner. I'm gonna apply a generous amount of this. After I've applied the leave-in conditioner throughout my hair, now I'm going to apply the frizz taming cream from Aussie. Miracle Curls for his taming cream. This smells so good and it works pretty well from what I can tell. And now I'm gonna go in with my multicultural styling product from Miss Jessie's. This is just the curling lotion. So I'm gonna apply this towards the ends of my hair, which is what I basically have been doing throughout this whole time, is just applying product towards the ends, because my roots are already as oily as it can get. So my goal is to apply product towards the ends so the ends are like good to go, if that makes sense. And now I'm gonna take a brush. I'm just gonna brush down my hair. Just to see, this is, I'm trying this, I've never done this before, so I'm just hoping it does something. This is just trying for me to try to get all the product inside of my head. I think I'm trying, don't mind me, this is my first time brushing my hair while doing it outside of the shower. This is, this is the brush, this is the brush that I use inside of the shower, but I'm trying it outside of the shower. It definitely is making my curls a little bit more defined, that's for sure. We still have a ways of product to go to apply into my hair. The next product we're going to be using is the Quick Curls Curling Cream. And I'm just going to apply a little bit of that in there at the ends of my hair, like I've been saying to do before. Jesse. So I'm gonna scrunch this into my hair. I'm also gonna be finger curling some of my curls. I'm just scrunching it throughout my whole entire head. Scrunch from the back of my head. My hair over in 
scrunch it. dries how it looks like after it's wet my hair is definitely softer but I wouldn't I don't know how the curls are until after well it's been a couple of hours after and then about two hours and I let my hair dry it's still a little damp but this is basically the aftermath I think it looks like I'm, I'm amazed I think it looks a little bit more defined definitely like as you can see the front pieces I mean the back is a little bit frizzy part my curls are like this is defined to me. I need to still keep treating my hair, moisturizing it, keep on doing hair masks, deep conditioning, all that stuff to get the better results. So like the more you do it, the more you practice it, the better the results will be. But from what I can tell from today's out from today's treatment and everything I did, my curls are pretty defined. Like as you can see, that's pretty defined to me. It could be more it could be a little bit less frizzy. But for like the most part, I'm pretty happy with my end result. Okay, so I just got out the shower. Excuse my appearance. Sorry about that. But I literally just, I literally just finished washing my hair. I, I shampooed, conditioned, brushed it out, and yada yada yada. Now I'm about to use this rapid recovery treatment. It's supposed to like basically recover your hair if it's like dry, damaged, whatever. And it has shea butter and avocado butter. It says the best storm repair cream treatment ever. And basically you use it once a week. It's in my hair for 30 minutes. I'm about to style it in my hair section by section. And then you rinse it and then you style after. And I'm gonna also going to be using this in the shower. You can't see it right now, but it's a cleansing milk from Camille Rose. It with flaxseed milk and rose powder and it helps with definition. And yeah, you just section and massage through your hair onto scalp throughout the length of using your fingers. Rinse with cool water until completely removed. Follow with the conditioner I just picked up from Miss Jessie. It's the Miss Jessie's leave-in condition. And yeah, so I personally love Miss Jessie now. Like I'm a new fan of it, which is why I picked up their leave-in condition. I haven't tried Camille Rose. Maybe I'll do another part two to this video and try Camille Rose leave-in condition. The Garnier Fertis leave-in condition I was using before was so-so, but I wanted to try more expensive. I mean, it's not that expensive. It was fourteen dollars, but that is a little bit pricey for the leave-in conditioner, considering my Garnier for two leave-in conditioner was about I want to say five to six dollars. So yeah, that was a little bit more than that. But we shall try these products out along with also this product, which is the Rapid Recovery Hair Treatment. So I'm gonna go ahead and style this in my hair, leave it in, rinse it out, and then use this conditioner, and then we'll get into the styling after. <laughs> so it's been in my head for about over 30 minutes, almost an hour, pretty much an hour. So now I'm about to rinse it out 
and I will get back to you guys shortly. Looks after the treatment. I mean, honestly, I was expecting like magical to find curls, but at the end of the day, a treatment is a treatment. You have to keep doing it repeatedly. So I'm gonna do it for another week and see how it goes. Here to the side.